There's a chance that they won't. No, they know. They know when they're on their way. And that's not a battle that I would uh, come out on top from. Keep those war taxes. I need to survive here somehow. That 56,000 stack is the only one that's really keeping me from uh, from acting here. Ah, oh, the capital's not that big a deal. I can take it back in a heartbeat. Kind of burning my manpower here, which is a damn shame. However, I know what I can do, and I will act on it, and it's called 10 to 1. Gotta, for, gotta remember, I'm getting ticking war score all the while because I do just, uh, well, I have enough war score from it. French, you're moving north, Jake. So I see, and so I shall act. Dry lands or you? I'd rather take on the easier ones and then smash into these guys. Less chance of the battle dragging on. That's the spirit. Time for you all to die. Just don't see any French coming south, please. Oh, I see them. Oh boy, I see them right. Thank God for that. Away you go. And that's a nice battle victory, but just not nice enough. When does war even start? June 50... Ooh, is that so? Is that so? Hey, you French, get the hell away from me. You want something? Go and siege down Malaga. The French flagship sunk again! <laughs> Oh, those suckers. Right, there's no decent docks around here, is there? Nah, why would there be? Just in case I can get some better repairs. It would only be for one tick, so no big deal. Right, if they're keeping themselves busy like that, I've got good opportunity for more stack wiping. Now, the French would take my capital in a heartbeat, which sucks, but... But, but, but... Oh, we're close. I'll do what has to be done. At all costs. This other war isn't so bad compared to having the French knocking on your door. I did say I wanted Navarra come hell or high water in this war, but I might have to pass on that one. Forgetting it seems like a tall order. The French are around, but they shouldn't, shouldn't get in the way of this. Officers not gentlemanly enough, who would have thought? Not enough elegance. Dangerous running that close to the ultimate um, French stack, but if I pierce you there in the mountains, maybe I can chase you down with the, the superior maneuver of Meow. Ha 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 ha, there we go. That's some war score, isn't it? However, I do want Navarra, and it's only 4%. To take it, I would need Labourd. I think. This is something we should do. No, god damn it, Tenez! If you're that useless, get out of the war! I'll let them get cozy there. And then we're taking Navarra and Labourd. Oh, but this is still happening. Ah, gonna lose that fort. That's gonna kinda cut me off, which is unfortunate. Sardinia appears now, which is good. I could pick on them if I so desired. Curse the Alema. Let's grab ourselves some stability, lose ourselves some war exhaustion, take the recommendations, and carry on north. Oh, that was nice. That was very nice. I wish I could punch them right off of here, but with all those Frenchies, it's a dangerous proposition. Hmm. I mean, I do really want Navarra. Cannot deny it. What's more, my flagship is good at uh, dealing with coastal fort. Well, dealing with forts in general. Blow those walls down, enjoy our general, and get everything we can done to make Labourd ours. Mm, 
they're spread out in an interesting fashion. I might be able to take advantage of this. Almost the one shot, almost. Well now, isn't that sweet? Why is the fort thing not applying here though? Normally it does. Maybe it's just not applying in the Coalition War. If you're taking Navarra, you might as well take Paris. I like your attitude, however, uh, times are very, very rough and I'm about to lose my capital and another fort. So let's keep that in mind. Almost there, almost there! Oh yes. I think that is what you call overwhelming victory. Hey, I'd get most of the money if I just took Dosh. They did cost me a lot of money in all of this, but Navarra is worth uh, a whole lot of gold to me anyway. <laughs> that was something else. Really something else, but get out of my goddamn land. There we go. We have done it. We've been. Oh man, they got a weapons manufacturer here. I don't want to lose that mosque, but uh, we're losing that mosque. Because what I need is a fortification. And then between them, these two will hold off everybody coming into Iberia. Hucha. That was so tough. Drain me of money, manpower, and I'm still stuck in another coalition war. However, 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 we got this. We can finish off our cores, stop paying off all that. Oh yeah, corruption is growing, isn't it? That's a bit of a problem. Just a little bit of a problem. Right, mercs, one place. Non-mercs, another we're still uh, we're still fighting here however the conditions have changed hey at this rate Majorcan separatists could take over uh, Aragon I don't think they have any capacity to take it back right now now, Cyprus, you are the war leader. You I can deal with without uh, any problem, I dare say. So I shall deal with you without any problem. Now that you're done with the war, you can do more war, says Anohito. Exactly. Uh, tech 14 is the next tech for, uh, for the better forts, and I will get them when I can, but it's expensive. Heeds up on starting integrations before failing coalition fires. I'm already integrating Valencia. It's almost done. You remember the, the War of the Sunken French Flagships. I like it. Alright, they did excellent though. Let's get them back and perhaps I could even consider sending off more uh, more Iberians to the cold, unwelcoming uh, Frostlands. Because I want them gone. I want them very gone. Then again, it's a big risk to do it up here. It's all rubbish land. Grant Majorca to Valencia before the integration ends. I mean, I already have a permanent claim on it. The only reason I had Valencia was because I couldn't handle the overextension. Now I can, there's no need to hand it over. Dip is okay. Right, if I don't get somewhere with uh, exporting all of these, uh, all of these unworthy Iberians, nothing's going to get going. So, looking at it, who could go? Do we still have separatism around here? We do not. No, we really don't. So, uh, Kunka, Kunka, and. Um, and Lisboa could both go, and that would be beneficial. We'll do it down here so we finally get a colonial nation. And I'll also be able to erect a couple of units to keep the place on lockdown. So where are we looking at? Uh, da, 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 da. I didn't um, I didn't revoke the dimmy, did I? I was meant to and I didn't. 
get out of here. I mean, sure, they're unhappy about it, but uh, why would they not be? And Kunka, no estates there, so... Yeah, it's 62. One thing that I can do, which is rather nice, is put this in here, so 62 becomes not 62. There we go, 48. I like the sound of that. Off you trot. And then we'll have to deal with this revolt, but we will deal with this revolt. And nice of Valencia to desiege my land for me. This war is not so bad. There's no major uh, person involved other than Poland. It's a shame that Portugal involved, but I'm just going to have to have to cry myself to sleep on that one. Man, everyone's so mad at me. Why would they be so mad? And here they come pouring in as usual, but we know how to deal with that. Because there's no America. America is just a bit different from how you might remember it. Don't worry about it. I think we'll get the uh, the Mercs to do the bulk of the everything here because I can't uh, can't afford the manpower losses. They will first take care of the religious revolt and then those that are pouring in because uh, man, I want the defensive edict here, but it's not not coming fast enough. What are you up to, Brittany? Why would they be sending eight transports down here? Son of a gun. They were already at it. <laughs> the truce with the big first one's going to be up in a year and a bit. And then I get to eat another coalition war. Pacify some borderline people. Not a lot of borderline when I have a hundred... Uh, 150 aggressive expansion with Europe. But that's okay, we can hold out. Improve relations would be nice and all, but... They just hate my guts. Okay, well, England is close enough to the fence that I could probably chase them out of it. We'll get you down and then kick some arses over here. Again, though, that's my gold. I like my gold. Leonese separatists just doing what they do, but as long as they cause problems in Castile, it's fine. There we go. Actually, yeah, that's just enough to take care of my fort there, which is a shame. I'll have to deal with the Bre uh, Bretons in due time. We're losing, though. Just occupations on Yolof's side, that's okay. Um, I guess I could finish you off. You're just causing me problems. No, but you're also causing Castile problems, so that's okay. We'll go and deal with these people rolling on in. Oh, yeah. It's alright, my fort is there in uh, Warcha for good reason. Still too many of them, sire. But Cyprus, Cyprus I can knock out uh, by taking their capital. Uh, that alone would be enough, but it'll certainly contribute. Not shipping off the Portuguese? Ah, how could I forget? What about releasing a vassal in southern France, scootaging or marching it for a buffer? I'd rather have the land myself, because then I can stick on the defensive edict, as long as I actually have them as, uh, as full-on states. Right, this one's not as useful as having you, though. Must have, must have. I need more states pretty badly, actually, that's what the next tech is all about. Three of them, so that's pretty good. I'd happily recall from some uh, North African ones to make that happen, though. Let's score some victory, though. Victory is needed. That fort being built in, in uh, what's its face, is about to get cancelled. Not on my watch. 
Not on my watch. Does it, do forts get cancelled when they get captured? I don't remember that. I mean, there's a lot of things I don't remember, so go figure. But I need to get it going anyway. Don't need to spy network Algeria, I can just fight them well enough. Strong High would be my friend again, and uh, they're no longer uh, governed by someone cruel. So I'd like to get that back, because they can help defend down here. Well, not just help, they do defend down there. I'll get over with my transport so I can do some stuff with you. Yeah, the Mallorcan Separatists can do their own thing. I don't particularly care about the province. If you want to go to Washk, then please do. I'll kill you, then kill your friends. Kill your dog. Shame I don't get numbers on how many punitive wars there are when they're done by different people. If only. Now, Cyprus, are all their units at home or away? I would like to drop in and take that, but it's probably better to get the, the war score from battles first. Don't think anyone will reinforce this. It's a good battle for me. And look at them spread out like that. Born to die. Right, rebels are about to enforce, it's the Majorcan ones. Now I took this land, I don't particularly want to give it up like that, so I will uh, I will take back Majorca. i got the units right here for it, and hell, I even have 33 transports, which is enough for all of these guys, cool. We'll get this done, get you onto Majorca, and then, you know, the uh, the others can eat the, the pain of that. But first off, winning battles, get the ticking war score, and then somehow come out of this on top. I didn't core this province. Well, the fort is more important. And with a defense like this, we're okay. There we go. Integration of Valencia. Fantastic. Dip rep goes down the toilet, which is not fantastic. But... I got myself some free units, which are about to get themselves killed if I leave them like that. Let's get them back here. Some free boats that I don't think I care that much about, but they're not putting me over the force limit. And there's a Breton Navy once again, dropping off more buggers. But they can't even see the gold, I think, so it's alright-ish. Right. Say no to Mallorcan separatists. I'll kill them as well so they stop just taking over my land like that. And what do we have here? Oh, I've managed to retake, um... Yeah, Balanchiria. Murcia, Albana, Valencia area. Yes, because I got the Valencia area. Rebuilding mosques, given unrest and better missionary speed. That's cool and all, but I don't I don't want to need any of these, but I'll take it anyway. I'm not going to be converting with missionaries. I'm going to be shipping them off, is what I could say, but religious unity has been better. Ah, they all contribute. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, forget all that then. Still, this is a great area, and I want it as a full state. I have the full cores after all. So it would make sense to find one of the wimpiest areas I have and just say, nah, not for me. Or to punch out a whole load of admin from the Ulema. Because they are pretty lame. Seek their support. Wait, what? <laughs> Something must have just ended there. Um, but I'll get that and then get a sweet 150. Then, excellent. Full on. This one I want full on as well, but uh, in a moment. This one probably as well. Let me 
may as well kill some boats while we're here. Leave a boat or else Aragon will unsiege. Do Aragon even have a navy? Aragon have four transports, so yeah, they they could. Um, but I'm not at war with Aragon, so they would do it anyway. I don't think anyone's really getting out of this coalition stuff that they all have with me. But hey, if the Ottomans were on my side again, how nice would that be? Just like old times, eh? As long as the rebels can actually get here, which they might not. Yeah, all these navies flying about are uh, are undoing that. Well, it's no big deal, right? I cancelled it for now. What I should do is go and kill Corfu. A bit risky, but I'll take it. Especially since the Bretons aren't getting any closer to us down in our gold. Jake, if you blockade the rebels in the island, they won't be able to defeat the rebs. Yeah. Yeah, you're not wrong there, are you? Bit risky to just send these guys out to do it, but... Yeah, you guys are already locked. We'll see if we can't make it there in time. They'll be there on the 11th, we'll be there on the 17th. That's not good. That's not good enough. Well, they'll be back there eventually. I don't really care about it being taken every now and then. Do you have any long-term goals for the campaign? Yeah, we are going to uh, culturally enrich all of Iberia. Spy network guy. I'll pass. I like being prestigious. Alright, if we're over here, then it's all the faster that we can siege down Cyprus. However, new coalition incoming in a few months. which is um, very dangerous and scary for me. But it can't involve France, and France won't be involved until 64 at least. Yeah, we're done with war taxing, even though it's hella expensive. Mercs being better, yes please. Could you re-ally GB? Not when I'm at war. But we have a great relationship, and he would if I wasn't at war. So if I can get this war done, which I can't right now, then it looks all the better. It would have to be before the other coalition war comes in, though. Hey, this is kind of nice for harvesting um, a war score. If I could just jump on Cyprus every now and then, he would likely get his army back up. Crunch! Better forts incoming. Well, there goes the truces, and likely here comes the war. Can't forget Castile, I need to declare war on them in 64, but they're not allied with GB at least. Yeah, there we go. Oh, this is quite nice. The Aragonese tried to take their land back, and the Majorcans kill them. And this is my good opportunity to keep them stuck there. My boats will be quite um, fragile out here. They might get sniped, but keeping them there is just glorious. Oh man, coalition incoming. Can't forget Bohemia is the emperor. Man, France, do you think you could, you know, not hate me so much? The 508 aggressive expansion probably says no, but man can dream. Cyprus needs to go down so I can get some peace and quiet. There we go, Cyprus down. He won't take peace because he's only part of the war, but it's going to massively speed up our chances of getting peace. Legalism, please, because I desperately need money, and there's nothing like enforcing faithful adherence for that to happen. Also, we didn't discuss it at the time, but Mohammed Nasrid... Nah, swimming lessons are tempting for him, but we'll pass on that for now. He's not that bad, and he has it in mill. And mill is pretty important. Oh, man. Please. Scoring this battle, I think, should be enough. But 
the fort's almost done. Thank God for that. Oh, where are they off to? They're going for my cat. Yeah, they are. They finally decided to go for my uh, my fort. That's fine. I'll kill them, but not with these uh, considerably more precious um, men. Mercs I can throw into the meat grinder, but actual manpower? No thanks. Tempting to strike down Sardinia and take their lands, but uh, expansion is a bit halted for me since I don't have states for anything. Jake, any strong European allies? Or they all hate you for being Muslim. They all hate me because I'm a Muslim who attacked Catholics. Uh, of note, those that don't hate me so much are the ones that were not Catholics, and so Naples won't coalition. Well, they probably will after I do other horrible things. Wait, didn't I have. Oh, they control both sides so they can move freely, is that right? That's probably right. And hilarious. Alright, this is all fun and games, but I need those troops of mine back to defend that fort. And it's still, uh. Still waiting on the core on that fort. Why don't I just land directly on it? There we go. Oh, there we go. Denmark and friends are all joining in, because that's the, that's the cool thing to do these days. That said, they're looking less and less threatening now, aren't they? Yes, they are. Wipe them out. We shall save our capital. Get back to here where the force limit is good. And at least I'll be a happy bunny. I wonder what Yolov thinks about all of this. He's probably mad as hell. But that's just a guess on my part. France slandering us. It's hard to get by as a moor, right? Everybody wants you dead. But we're doing the best we can. Also, goodbye, Whitelaw. You served us very well, actually. And I think I'd be doing an injustice if I didn't grab another general whilst we're so good on the everything right now. But who will it be? I think it's time we had Olwens back in the seat. It's been a while. Oh, he's pretty awful. I think Olwen's has been slacking these days. That's terrible for 83. Um, that's terrible for 83 uh, army tradition. Let's try again. These are bad. Well, we'll have them around. They're not doing us any harm, except for the fact that I want an explorer. I should probably also get another one of these going. But who? Who needs to go? Ah, well, of course. If I get you, it, it's going to make things cheaper for all around here. So what I will do is say... Uh, Medina Lachwant. Medina Lachwant. Pretty cheap as well. Off you go, go. Be nice to have another couple thousand just to keep the place under wraps, but these two can converge if the going if the going is needed. Bit of an expense as well, but expense is the name of the game around here. Next tech is quite far away, Jake. You could still do some re-rolling. Yeah, it really is, but you know, I'm not capped on mill power, so why bother? Right, what do we have here? Ferrara and Brabant. They're both in that same war. And I would like to kick them out, but uh not that bad right now. I can get you over there, I think. You folks. Deal with the Separatists. And of course, they all have their navies, and they think they're better than me, and they're wrong. So let's go take them down. Just in case you lose all your land. You got land in the New World. And I do, but... I wonder where Britain's colonizing. He might be going around here having sussed out that all this land is 